What we've discovered over years of handling cases of abused children is that, ironically, the children feel guilty and ashamed and they want to cover up this crime that has been perpetrated on them. And ironically, the criminal, the pedophile that committed the crime, uses that instinctive fear and shame as a way to keep the victim from talking. And when the victim doesn't talk, the pedophile is allowed then to go on and victimize other children. And what's rewarding about this particular area of our practice is that it helps the victims because they're allowed to come out and, and begin the healing process. And it also helps us put an end to the victimization of children in organizations that for many years have allowed it to go on unchecked.